It's your girl, Shayna Monet, and I'm back with another video. And it's hot. Um, I wasn't gonna do a video today. I was not. But, 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 I'm gonna stick to my what I'm gonna do, you know? I'm about to stick to this making videos every single day until I got my point across, or I got, until, I'm where I feel like I need to be and so yeah and I wasn't gonna I really wasn't gonna do a video today y'all but I'm, I'm gonna do this one I'm not gonna make this one as long as the last one because that one was 20 minutes long and I ain't even wanna I ain't even wanna freaking watch it myself but um I, I did say a lot of good stuff in there and I did you um, know I'm happy that I did put that video out because that video been meaning to come out for the last like whatever anyways as the title of this video um we're gonna be talking about how when I stop loving myself and what it turned into I guess so believe and like I said I've y'all I've been over these last it's what been seven days now since the last the first video I posted that I post on Wednesday or Tuesday but and I told you I'm gonna turn this into a life cleanse and just get myself back together you know and over these last few days and not even days it was before that I was just thinking like like when like did everything start happening in my life so life or when I just had to take what happened in my life, all of my life, and start pinpointing things because of the fact that it's like me pinpointing and, 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 and learning why and now telling why. It's like it's, it's helping me move forward. <clears throat> so this one is like when I start, stopped loving myself and I feel like me stop loving myself came at a really 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 early age and i want to say it was as early as around first and second grade because i always felt and like me thinking like it's crazy how people will remember things from like long time a long time ago but it's like i remember the feelings that i felt and i just it seemed like either people didn't want to hang with me or people didn't think I was pretty and then to the point that I was young and did not think I was pretty and y'all I don't know why because I was a pretty little girl and I'm gonna put some pictures right here I was a pretty little girl and I was just like I don't know I would just let people get in under my skin like my nose is too big my my teeth are too buck my my it just it always was something that got to me I didn't have all the nice clothes um or something like that you know and it, it really really got to me at a young age and I can I can still feel those feelings and it's like in elementary school it was just it, it literally was it was I, I just didn't love myself and a lot of people say from books and a lot of watch I, I watch a lot of like motivation videos and stuff and a lot of people that study why women start stop loving themselves at a young age because in it it's always because they didn't have that father figure they didn't have a lot of people say that the first person that's supposed to love a woman is their father and not saying that my father didn't love me and not saying like that he didn't try he did try you know I'm not saying none of that I'm not getting into depth I'm not saying like you know that's the that's the past I do believe that but I feel like not having that at a really really young age was it hurt and I'm not gonna lie and be like nobody I've never had a father type figure and I have I've had a fit a, a father type figure and 
it helped a lot but I don't think it's still the same as I think I, I still needed that love from my from my dad and it sucks but I mean now that I'm getting older it's like I can see it and I can realize it and I can you know but yeah so then like I said elementary school that's when it started really and then like around third grade that's when I started yeah, around the, so if you don't know me I felt the third grade and it really wasn't I, I mean I was talking to somebody the other day and it was like stop saying that you failed the third grade because you were going through a lot and I was I moved a lot and it's like I kind of comprehend and then you know I just had I was stressing at a young age as well and I'm gonna stop saying I, I, I failed the third grade I'm gonna start saying I repeated because I was going through a lot but I repeated the third grade and my first year of third grade <laughs> remember this boy and I really wanted him to like me so much like and it was like he was just like acting like he didn't like me and then he ended up it's like I just kept like nagging him to the point that it was like he like just was like I like you da, 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 da. and then I remember him like talking and like on the side and I was like and he was like to his friend or whatever he was like I told her but I had to tell her because she wouldn't leave me alone like she she I had to tell her I like her because because I didn't like I couldn't keep it a secret because she wouldn't she wouldn't like let me like you know and now that I think about that I'm like I was really trying to make this boy like me like, I really wanted to know if he really liked me so I don't remember the whole story or whatever but I, I, that's the part I do remember and then I think from that point on I looked at I looked for love and I looked for people liking me and, and a lot in boys and I just I just that's how I was and then I think I think fifth grade I had a little boyfriend and then it was like I wanted him to like me so bad and it's like I wanted to I was gonna do things and stuff like that and it's like I just wanted him to like me so bad or like I wanted him to stay with me stuff like that right and it was like now that I think about it, I was like why but or I wanted to be around the the popular well I'm gonna say popular because that's how we that's how the media says it or like if you watch TV and stuff so I wanted to be popular I wanted to be with the cool girls stuff like that and it was to the point like like if anybody know like okay everybody know twerking so we used to so in the dmv well dc maryland area because dc they got go-go so we would call it clapping um and i used to make clapping videos it was <laughs> it was it's funny now i can laugh about it i really can genuinely laugh about it but it was like it was like why you know i was just doing everything to to want to be seen and it's because I just didn't I didn't feel like it was like if I didn't I didn't I wasn't pretty enough I wasn't you know and then we got to middle school and it was that's when I started finding loving other people too and then I had my girlfriend and then I have you know the guys and then it was like I was I was starting to get that attention I was starting to get that attention that I wanted and it wasn't always good attention and you know, I, I I was just starting to get attention, and then I like I, I met my uh, girlfriend at the time, and I was like, I really really like her, and like like I thought I loved her, and it was just like I felt love for once. And then we we'll skipped to high school, so high school was a whole another branch, y'all, because y'all know it be grown men. Well, they don't be grown, but they, it be grown looking, and it's like you in middle school, but then we get to high school, it be grown looking, it be grown looking woman, it be, little, it be grown looking everything. And I've been trying to freaking, I really don't think it's this one. I'm gonna go to the next one. But it's like, oh, wait. 
you know it is the next one so um yeah and it was just like i was like oh yeah so then that's when the, the boys started coming for real and mm, girls too and it was like it was like i was getting this attention i really liked that attention and all the attention i got i was really liking and then it turned to sex for love and i'm not and i'm going to be honest with you in this video like i did i turned to i thought that like me having sex was a way to keep people around a way to to feel like i was wanted and a lot of my high school year it was like it was just like that's what i was doing i was turning to sex for love and it hurt because it was like i i i don't know it, it was like i really like i really wanted it like i want it was like I don't know, I really don't know. Like I just I just know that I, I was turning to sex for love and uh and I thought that was a form of love and I really like I really 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 I just really thought that was what love was. And it clearly it wasn't. It wasn't what love was. And now that I'm getting older I understand that. I, I understand it a lot more than what I did, you know? And um Walmart is over there, so I need to go this way. So, when I got to high, out of high school and in here, I was doing the same thing. It was like, but this time it was on like a savage mode. Like, it was like, I was getting this attention because I knew that I was the new thing. And it's crazy because it's like, but it's, it's true, like, it's like I knew that I was the new thing and I just knew like that I was just something different and nobody nobody ever seen seen Shayna nobody ever seen this type of girl and I was off some I didn't care type uh, ish like I was just like I had I was using people guys and I was like I was off some we're gonna say nigga shit and I know uh, I don't want to I didn't want to use that word we're gonna say no i'm gonna use that word i'm only gonna use that word that time but that's what i was off of and it was off some like i was off male stuff like i didn't care like i just i wanted to be a dog like i was being a dog and a female in in my body and i can't even say it was a hoe because i was playing games better than a lot of these dudes i'm not gonna even lie and that's how i was and that's when I thought I started loving myself, but even then I wasn't really like, I wasn't like, damn, you look good. Damn, you look, you don't need that. Damn, you, no, it was, it was like I was still finding it in other people. And yeah, like, I don't think, so then I met my, you know, my girlfriend, my ex-girlfriend right now, but anyway watch my first video you'll hear about that anyway um well not first video but the video it, it should be linked down below but i had um pretty much found it so i have found myself i started finding myself a lot in this year and i can i can honestly say i didn't love myself this whole time i really i started loving myself this year and it was like I had to go through some things and it was hard but I had to realize and my friend because she is a friend to me now um she helped me a lot she helped me to find like cause when she first met me she really thought I was like this motivated person and it was like i was i was i was but it was like i wasn't it was like i was given this front that i was so motivated and i had a i had an ambition i had ambition and i did but it was like i didn't take the steps to keep going like it was like i was telling myself i had it i had it i had it and then would just stop 
and to the point that like some days I would get like really really sad or I'll I'll just I'll just stop and I'll just be like I don't love myself or I don't feel like I'm I'm worthy enough for something or I'm pretty enough for something it was literally that's literally how I was feeling and um a lot of the time she sat me down and was like why do you feel like this stop stop being so insecure I was so insecure with myself y'all and it was it, it really sucked and I think I didn't start loving myself until last week I didn't start and I'm still working on on you know being in love with myself but I didn't start really loving myself until literally last week until I had to sit there and be like why are you like this like what is it can you that you can do that that you can find your peace and I had to realize I had to love myself and I had to to just to move forward and yeah so that's my story on when I started loving myself and to move forward with loving myself it's really taking my time and learning myself and and doing what I want to do you know like not not saying like what I want but like what I just what I what I know like taking what I want to do in my future and putting it towards that now like I've been watching motivational videos I've been forced I, I found a, a happy space like I found a space that I can be in peace and I'm going there right now after I um, run into five below and it was like I'm just better I'm, I'm getting better and every time like I know when I get like yesterday I was so sad and I was crying 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 and as soon as I stepped in this place it was like and I found and I'm happy where the place that I found I'm not gonna say it now and I don't want to say it right now I mean it's nothing bad it's actually really good but I don't want to say it right now because it's just I just don't I just want I want that place to be my place I want it to be where I only know about it you know so yeah um, I'm working on loving myself and like I said y'all are gonna follow me in this whole journey thank you all for watching thank you all for supporting my last two videos um, tomorrow I'll see y'all tomorrow and uh, yeah the beauty videos will be coming up soon so don't think like I, I, I'm, I'm stopping on the beauty videos nope I just don't do nothing during the week y'all but um yeah it's gonna be videos every day from now on y'all aren't if I go missing then because mm -mm, I got I'm moving forward from this point on point blank period but anyway I love y'all talk to you on the next video and yeah